Well, a violent weekend in Milwaukee, leaving several people injured and a two year old dead. The city is on pace to have more shootings this year than even record breaking numbers that we saw in 2020. CBS 58 Kristen Barbarisi talking with community leaders about this troubling trend that's happening. Kristen. Jessup, this weekend we had a triple shooting. We had teens shot and injured. We had that toddler killed and experts and activists say it's hard to stop gun violence like this from spreading. A violent 24 hours in Milwaukee, 11 people shot in eight separate shootings. With the COVID-19 restrictions, uh, anxiety, depression is up, uh, domestic abuse is up. A lot of things are uh, bubbling over. Among the victims, a two year old accidentally shot and killed and three teenagers shot, but all expected to survive. Dr. Terry Darun Cassini, a trauma psychologist, says survivors of gun violence face challenges, especially when their brains aren't fully developed. We have 18, 19, 20 year olds getting shot and it definitely can impact the brain's ability to regulate emotion. Dr. Darun Cassini says this can lead to mental health problems, a desire to retaliate and perpetuate the cycle of violence. When individuals are feeling heightened sense of fear, individuals can be hyper responsive to things going on around them. Their behavior can look erratic. Tori Lowe says the community needs to step up. We need our community to help us because a lot of people in the community are harboring some of these people who are not caught for shooting other people. The mayor's office and the director of the Office of Violence Prevention declined to comment. Lowe says it's frustrating they aren't putting forward more solutions. What are they going to say any different than what they've said all summer? Plus, they're not giving people the tools. Lowe says that he's worried the end of the eviction moratorium is going to further escalate the violence with people losing their homes and adding to their stress. Live in Milwaukee, Kristen Barbarisi, CBS 50.